Welcome to the Science Kid. I'm your host, Quinn Friedman, and today we're going to learn about plants. Oh. Not many people think about it, but plants are extremely important. Without plants, we wouldn't be able to survive. There are 350,000 different types of plants. Wow. Each type of plant is unique and needs certain features to survive, like each of us. Some people think the only thing we get from plants is fruits and vegetables. However, plants are way more than just a pile of berries. One thing that plants give us are nutrients. When we eat plants, we take in certain nutrients that we need to survive. All animals need these nutrients to survive. However, you may be wondering how do meat eaters get these nutrients? Carnivores eat animals that have eaten other plants to get their own nutrients. Another thing we get from plants is oxygen. When you breathe in, you're taking oxygen from the air. This oxygen has been spread from plants. When you breathe out, you're releasing carbon dioxide in the air. Plants need carbon dioxide to survive. In this diagram, you can see that plants and animals give each other something in the air that is both beneficial for their survival. Lastly, we get another thing from plants. The wood inside trees is used into buildings, furniture, paper, and other types of objects. Without plants, we couldn't build these objects. Also, the cotton in clothing is taken from cotton plants. Without plants, this suit wouldn't be here today. After plants die, they decompose into mush. Now, you'd think this mush is useless. However, this mush can be used into making amazing fertilizer to grow new plants. I bet you all have learned that animals and plants need energy to survive. Animals like us get energy by eating other animals and plants. Mmm. Carrots. Great. Good for your eyes. However, how does plants get their energy? They don't have mouth like us. However, they should because these are really good. Delicious. <laughs> plants get their energy by taking sunlight from the sun. Right up there. They take this sunlight, mix it with carbon dioxide, rich soil, and water to make nutritious sugars. This process is called photosynthesis and is formed by a chemical called chlorophyll. Now you know that plants are super important. They provide oxygen, building materials, food, and nutrients for each of us animals. Thank you guys for watching this episode of The Science Kid. If you did enjoy it, make sure to subscribe and like down below. Thank you guys for watching. And remember, science can always be fun.